This deployment is vital for the security of our state and our nation. South Dakota Governor Christine Nome announced she's sending up to 50 troops to Texas to help protect the U.S.-Mexico border. This after Texas Governor Greg Abbott issued a disaster proclamation stating the surge of individuals unlawfully crossing the Texas-Mexico border posed an ongoing and imminent threat of disaster to several Texas counties. States sending their National Guard troops to help other states isn't new. So why are we talking about this? While well, the deployment of South Dakota's National Guard is funded by a private donation, and many people on social media are asking if that's legal. So let's verify. Is it legal for South Dakota's governor to use donor funds to deploy the National Guard? Our sources are South Dakota Law, the National Guard Public Affairs Bureau, a spokesperson for Governor Kristi Noem, and Willis Johnson, CEO of the Willis and Reba Johnson Foundation, the organization whose donation is paying for this deployment. I know there's been some questions about the private donation that is paying for this deployment. On several occasions, our state has partnered with private citizens on projects that are important for South Dakota. There are two South Dakota state codes that allow the governor to accept donations and use those funds as they see fit. Under SDCL 34-48A-36, the governor can accept offers and donations. It also gives the governor authority to divert those funds at their discretion. According to SDCL 5-24-12, even if there are any strings attached to the donation, the governor can still pass that donation to the state if it's determined accepting the donation is in the best interest of the state. Willis Johnson, who gave the donation to South Dakota through his foundation, told Verify he knew Governor Nome wanted to send troops to the border and believed she'd use his donation for that purpose, saying, quote, I trust her word and what she was going to do, so I did it. In a statement to verify, a spokesperson for the National Guard said a sitting governor has the authority to call up their National Guard to active duty status. The governor's officer told Verify they're following all applicable laws regarding the deployment and that, quote, the South Dakota National Guard has been activated for and will remain on South Dakota state active duty status in order to support Texas's EMAC, Emergency Management Assistance Compact request, end quote. So we can verify, yes, it is legal for the South Dakota governor to use a private donation to deploy the National Guard. With your Verify, I'm Ariande Till. Want something verified? Email us or send us a text. For more stories like this and to subscribe to our newsletter, go to verifythis.com.